was a tense couple of hours as a dramatic rescue played out today on Signal Mountain. It sure did. A 17-year-old boy was doing some landscaping work when he fell off the side of Walden's Ridge. It happened behind a home on Forest Park Drive where you could see that little red marker there. News Channel Line's Lindsay Jackson was there for the rescue today. Lindsay, what happened? Kim and Calvin were told 17-year-old Matt Bush and another guy were doing yard work and that both were belted in to prevent a fall like this from happening. But it was when they, took, they unbelted to take a break that he slipped and quite literally fell off the side of Signal Mountain. You can't see him from here, but Matt Bush is down there along with several rescuers. Initially, we were told he'd fallen 70 feet, but as rescuers made it down to him, they realized it was much further. Mark was there one moment, and the next moment he stepped onto something that he thought was stable, and it was not. Mm -hmm. And so that's when he took the fall. He fell 50 feet, then rolled another 250 down terrain that slopes and falls off and slopes again. Sherman Ford is with Walden's Ridge and is also a paramedic. He was the first to get down to Matt. Um, he was okay. You know, I'm, I'm not really allowed to talk about his condition per se, but he, he was talking to me. So. Was he panicked? Was he? Uh, no, he was calm, yeah. very calm. He was calm throughout the rescue. Fortunately, Matt had his phone with him, so he was able to let rescuers know where he was and what he thought his injuries were. Injuries that are not nearly as bad as you may expect. We're told that he had a head injury and a possible broken arm, but had great vitals and was alert for the whole rescue, which took several hours. We stabilized his spine. Mm -hmm. And then we secure him into, it's called the Stokes basket, it's the metal basket that we bring him up with. And it could have taken longer had Matt not had his cell phone and been able to talk to those rescuers. Nowadays, with cell phone as prolific as they are, it's pretty common. You know, in some search and rescue situations, we have used their cell phone signal to give us an exact GPS coordinate and locate them that way. Finding Matt and bringing him back up the mountain was probably most appreciated by Matt's parents, Mitzi yeah. and Myron. I'm just happy to see him. <laughs> <laughs> had, a, had a good ending. Yeah. Thanks for everybody's hard work. Thanks. Yeah, everybody worked real hard. What a lucky kid. Matt will be a senior this fall at Silverdale Baptist Academy. Tonight he is recovering at the hospital.